Sometimes when you're paddling more constricted or more difficult rivers, you're going to have to get out in places that are a little inhospitable. And when this happens, you're going to need a little bit more than just a grassy bank. And this is just one of the myriad of uses for your flip line. Pulling into the behind a rock here, you can get yourself situated. And once you pull in, make sure that you're not going to float away. You can undo the flip line from around your waist. And before it's fully unwound, hook it onto the bow of the boat. This leaves you hands free from the boat to make sure that it's not going to go floating away because you will need it later. At this point, you can take the webbing, hold it in your hand, or put it in your teeth. Now, as you hop out, get both legs out of the boat and try and hold a nice steady hand loop. Stand up. Make sure your paddle's not going anywhere. And then at this point, for the difficult ascent, you're now up and you can haul your boat up or just wrap it off to something to make sure it doesn't disappear off downstream.